Hello, today I am going to be teaching you how to manually install Legal Company mods. Say R2 Mod Man or Thunderstore wasn't working for you, or you have a cracked version of the game, which is, I'm assuming, what most of you are here for, that you want to play mods on. I can help you with that. Now, without that out of the way, let's begin. The first thing you want to do is install Bevan X Pack right here. I'll leave the link in the description, or you can just search for it yourself. It's just the Thunderstore link right here. It should be pretty easy to find. And then you're going to download all the mods that you want. I'm going to install Imperium. Keep in mind down here that your mod may require other mods to function, like Lethal Company Utils, which... And... X... Ne Lethal Network API, which also requires Lord Fire Speed. Thankfully, this one doesn't require anything, so just make sure you keep all of those in mind. Now, I already have them downloaded myself, so now what we're going to do is, if you have a cracked version of the game, go ahead and go into your um, Lethal Company save files. I have a real one, so you're going to go to Steam, click on the settings here, click on or go to Manage, click on Browse Local Files, Then you're going to open your downloads folder and drag, open the Pep and X pack folder that you downloaded. Go into this once and you should have these three files. Go ahead and drag them in. Place any files in the destination if that happens. Then um, go ahead and launch the game once. should see this. If you don't, that means you did something wrong. Once this pops up, just close the game. Now open all the mods you want. Go into Pepin X, plugins. If you don't see plugins, that also means you did something wrong or you didn't run the game. And you look for the folder with the same folder as the DLL or application extension. And everything inside that folder needs to be moved into this plugins folder. We have Bepinex connect. Now don't drag in the plugins folder only. Like I said, look for the DLL file and everything else inside the same folder as it and drag that in. Because sometimes it requires these asset bundles. Don't want to miss that, or else the game will not run properly. last few in. There we go. Everything should be good now. Now simply launch the game once and your mods should be installed. If you see any um, errors in the log here, oh, let me go up in that. Any errors in the log here? Um, you should definitely keep those in mind. Now, I have a big error here, but um, this doesn't actually matter. If you see anything like, um, this doesn't work with this because it couldn't find this, you definitely need to keep those in mind. That means you didn't install a required anything that might have been required. But right now, I'm doing just fine. So go ahead and launch your game. Uh, oops. Usually this doesn't happen, but I've never clicked on land before. That might be why. But I hope you enjoyed the tutorial, and thank you for watching. If you have any questions, my Discord um, user will be put in the description, as well as any links that you may want. Um... That should be all. Thank you for watching once again, and I will catch you later.